All right. Hi, everybody. My name is Speedy Science. I'm a TPT author and I specialize in middle school science resources. This video is going to be a 2024 uh, income report. So I'm going to go month by month and then I'm going to do a little review of everything. So uh, as you can see here, we have uh, right now about 276 reviews, about 200 followers, which I know doesn't really do much. Um, and as far as products goes, for the year 2024, I had around 350 to 400 products, more or less. Um, and I did not work on it very much, so keep that in mind. <laughs> I did not upload um, until basically December. Um, or I have uploaded a few here and there, but all right, let's get started. So January 1st, I made $1,136.84, which is a 51% increase from last year, $7.52. Uh, going forward, I'm not going to say the cents amounts, but yeah, pretty similar trends overall, but obviously a big increase, which I was really happy about. Then we went on to February. All right. And then I made for February uh, $1,013, up 28% from the previous year, $7.92. Uh, yeah, I think this is where I started to see that without putting in the work, so uploading a bunch consistently, uh, I wasn't going to be seeing those, you know, 2x gains that I was seeing at the very beginning, which makes sense, and it's understandable. But yeah, definitely some growth, which is cool. Okay. Next month for March 2024, I made $751, up 36% from previous year, so $550. Now, I think that once I got to $1,000, I was just hoping that it would just stay there forever, <laughs> but clearly not. Um, definitely still some growth, but I was hoping to get more of the, you know, 1000 plus range. Now that said, 751 that's still awesome. Last year, I was ecstatic when I got that amount, but yeah. All right, let's go to April 2024. I made $813, 30% up from last year, 623. Um, let's continue. We go to May. All right, I got $512, $512 uh, down 4% from the previous year, 534. So I didn't even know this could happen. I didn't know you could go from um, a higher number to a lower number in the same month because I just figured with the more reviews and more products that it would just always go up, but clearly not, and that's fine. Um, and ultimately it is quite similar. So that could be a bunch of things. It could be algorithms. It could be, you know, people buying less. I don't know. It's fine. All right, for June, I made $119. That was up 5.2% from 113. So pretty good. I mean, we're getting to the summer months and I'm not expecting very much. So let's go to July. Oh, wow. Okay, so $64 and we're down 24%. I made $85 the previous year. Um, yeah, I just, you know, life's like that sometimes, I suppose. And I, I always, I think Becca Davis is the one who I got this from, but I just figure that um, summer months, so June, July, will be zero, and then whatever I make is great, but no worries. All right, August for me is actually not like the blowout month that most people I've seen on, on the YouTubes have. Um, my So for August, I made $399, up 9.2% uh, from 365. So obviously like we're getting some increases, but it's not, you know, by far my highest month. So maybe I need to make more bundles and back to school stuff. Um, Cause yeah, it's definitely not the most. All right. September, September, I made 927 up 20% from 772. So, you know, we're getting close to that thousand dollar mark and I'm excited to get back to it. And spoiler alert, I do get back to it. Um, but yeah, very similar trends. It's kind of cool to see these graphs because I can see, I mean, there there are trends clearly with, you know, the weeks and uh, with holidays. All right, so October, 
for me is a pretty good month. I, you know, Halloween is there. I have a few Halloween things. I made a thousand dollars and a thousand two hundred fifty four dollars up ten percent from a thousand one hundred thirty seven. So not that much of an increase, but definitely still a good range. Uh, and especially considering that I was not putting in much work, I will take it. All right, November. Okay, November, I was, listen, I was excited to reach 1,500 um, because if I got 1,500 for the last two months, I would hit my yearly goal, but I did not, and that's fine. So I made $1,449, very close to 1,500, um, up 25% from $1,158, and pretty similar trends, and yeah, quite happy about that. And then December... So just, just this past month, I made $964, up 5.5% from $914. Um, again, this is a time where people are buying less because there is that, um, that week or two at the end that is a, the holiday break. Um, yeah, so let's go on to my full year. I'm going to go January to December. So just by the way, my goal was hitting $10,000 in one year pre-tax. Um, and I made, not too far off, but definitely did not hit my goal, I made a whopping total of $9,406, which is up 21% 20 uh, from the previous year, so $7,800. Let me just say, this is awesome. I am so pumped. And the fact that I was able to make this amount is mind-boggling to me because this is mostly passive income at this point. I mean, yes, I've put in a lot of work, a lot of work, but it, it, during this year, not so much because I was focusing on my classroom and I had a different prep and, you know, whatever. Um, I recently switched schools. And even with that, I mean, I, I had a couple goals that would, would have been fun to reach and I almost hit them. I wanted to make $100 in one day. I did not, but I did get 97 at dollars in November, so that's pretty close, and I expect to hit that uh, in 2025. And then I wanted to make 10,000, and I did not, but that's okay. Uh, really good numbers as far as you know, a side hustle that I was not even hustling in this past year. Um, December, I uploaded a bunch of stuff though, this just these past few weeks because I've been on break, and I am looking to start some more <laughs> consistency. So. I'm, I'm expecting that as I add more resources and I get more strategic about the whole thing, that the numbers will increase. So that's cool. I'm excited. Again, Speedy Science. Um, happy to be here sharing this with you. I really love income reports. I know some people don't, uh, and that's great. You don't have to watch them, but I'm always like refreshing YouTube to, to find what people are making because it's fun. Even if someone's making $10 versus $20,000 in a month, it's just cool to see where people are at. So Anyway, hope this was inspiring or motivational in some way. Um, yeah, I hope you have a great day. And hopefully next year I'll make even more. So, goodbye.